Hi everyone, it's Rachel. Chuck emailed a good question regarding sharing documents outside of your Google Apps domain on a Google Apps for Education domain. So I have run into similar glitches, uh, but I wanted to walk through the basics of how we've been able to do it. And if you have the same settings configured and you're still running into trouble, we can troubleshoot further. But for right now, here's a, a presentation that I'm working on for the summit next week. And I want to share it with myself, um, just maybe like my generic Gmail address. So in our control panel, in the Docs setting page, which again is just clicking on the actual Docs link for the settings, you'll see that there's a sharing options section right here, second section of the page. And we have it set so that on Oregon K-12 users can share. We get a warning when we try to share outside of the domain and we can publish documents um, to make them visible to the world. So I've double checked that my sharing options are set the way I need them to be. So now I'm back on my slideshow and I'm going to share this with again my Gmail address and my High Desert ESD address. We'll call it, try a couple different ones. And so I get my warning that they're both outside the domain and I click that's okay. And I see they do populate in my list. So now I'm going to go to my Gmail browser, which is Safari. And we talked about that on our call on Tuesday using different browsers for different Gmail or um, Google Apps domain addresses works really well. It helps uh, minimize the cookie issues. So for Gmail, here's my link to the Summit slideshow. And you see I'm in there. And I can see my slideshow. And my ESD browser is Firefox. So I'm going to go to items shared with me. And again, there's my Summit slideshow and here I am. So the key seems to be making sure that your dashboard is set up to allow you to share docs outside the domain. Again, we are running to a, into a few cookie issues and um, just a few headaches, but that's the, the best place to start first. Let me know if your settings are configured that way and they're still not working and we'll put it on our next tech agenda. Thanks everyone.